Going for birdie. That's right, Alan. Guys, welcome back to another video on the channel where today we're back up here at Green Acres Golf Club where we're going to be playing nine holes today, guys, on the channel. Nine holes. Handicap has currently went up, so we're currently playing on 13 handicap at the minute. Uh, golf speeding. Going downhill. Green Acres Golf Club, 13 handicap. How well can we do? Let me know down in the comment section put in what you think will go around at nine holes. But anyway, guys, if you haven't liked the video yet, go down there and smash that like button. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go down there and smash that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, we very much appreciate it. But Green Acres Golf Club, how well can you do over nine holes? Let's get it. Be okay. He's up there. Shot two. I've got, I'm going to try a nice little pitching wedge. Tell you what, guys, we nearly slam dunked out there. A little bit heavier at the grass, but we'll take it. Shot three. Just played it to the back of the green. Nice little pitching wedge. Try and roll one close. Going for birdie. Guys, what an absolute start. What an absolute start. We birdie. Oh, we birdie. Check there. Get in. Hole two, guys. Par four. Not the biggest par four. Get on this and two, you'll be happy. Great start. Birdie to start. Straight down the middle. What a drive. What an absolute drive. Down the middle, guys. We'll take it. Great start. 124 yards, guys. 124 yards of the pin. Pitching wedge in hand. Tell you what, it looks all right. Bit left of it. That should be right club yardage, maybe. Yep. Just left of it. Great strike. We'll take it beside the pen. Show for you guys. I went pitching wedge again for the beside the green. Pitching wedge should be the right club here. Just nice little roll out here from the rough. Get it close to the pen. Keep going. Keep going. Guys, that's what you call absolute perfection. We'll take this for par. Hopefully we can sink it. Hopefully. We have this pot here for par, guys. If we can sink this, I'll be happy. 30 par to start. Oops, don't do that. 30 par to start. Looks straight enough. 30 par to start. Come on, Dave. There we have it, guys. Just about made that. Nice little par to start. And on we go to the downhill par three next, which will be interesting. But anyway, 30 par to start, get in there. Par three, downhill, 167 yards, seven iron in hand. I think it might be too big. I've got a seven iron in hand. Let's hope we get a good strike here. Par three, downhill, seven iron in hand. Tell you what, it's right at it. Well, maybe not, it's a wee bit left. Maybe left green. Yep, just, just in between the two bunkers, guys. Great strike. Shot to you guys, we've actually just landed over the second bunker. Nice light seven iron and it still went. Which is incredible. So, shot two. Side of the bunker. Just need to get one to run off the fringe here. Tell you what, it's going to roll down the hill. Not a great chip, but I actually thought that was going to go in for a second 30 there. But anyway, just off the back. So we have a big one for par here, guys. Uphill as well. Come in, come in. Still big for bogey, that. Wow, that's rather old, a good bit. Still big for bogey. Wow, there we have it, guys. Double bogey in the par three. Double bogey in the par three. Not great, great strike off the tee box, but there we are with a double bogey. Guys, we're in hole four. It's another par four. This is the third par four out of the four holes. If we can get one straight down the middle here, I'd be happy. I want to try and keep it left and draw it in a little bit. Just stay in, I always go down that right hand side. Big drive, but it's always down in between the trees down there, right hand side. Can never get it down that middle of the fairway, but anyway, we're down there. Shot two guys. Pin's in a tricky position. I've got to go over this tree in front of me here. And we've also got to go over a bunker because the pin is at the front of the green, just behind the bunker. So nice little soft pitching wedge. I've kind of left my wedges in the boot of the car, so I'm going to have to play with pitching wedge all today for around the greens. See how well we can hit this. 
Tell you what, just make it over the bunker, that'll be good. Oh, nice little kick left as well. We'll take that, we'll take that. I need to go and check where it is now, guys, but it did take a kick left there. Hold on, it's actually rolled up. But we're putting downhill, birdie putting, putting downhill. Let's try and get it. We have this for birdie, guys. This is a big putt for birdie. Downhill. I'm gonna keep the flag in. If it hits it, hopefully it drops, or hopefully it doesn't kick left or right, but downhill birdie putt. Just want it close for par. Gonna have to aim it slightly right, because it is going down. It seems like it's going that way, I don't know. That's actually weird looking at it. It looks right to left to me, but try and keep it down the right hand side. Nice little tap. I need to be closer, I need to be clo That's not bad, we could possibly work with that for par. I'm gonna take the flag out. We can possibly work with that. Power pot. There we have it guys. Yeah again another par in the cards. The, the round of golf's going pretty good so far. And uh yeah, we're going well. Under the fifth hole guys, what a start. Let's keep going. Hole five guys, it's another long par four. We're actually now playing off proper tee boxes which is great we're playing off proper tee boxes no wind which is also great today nice warm day playing off proper tee boxes we've started strong we've went 30 par double bogey par another par or a bogey here i'll be happy to keep this strong streak going so anyway par four. Oh my god that was a little low left to right but that's gonna be bang center of the fairway and it's running from edge We'll take it guys, another solid strike down the middle and we'll keep it going, come on. Shot to you guys, I've got 8 iron in hand, 155 yards to the pin. So we've got an 8 iron in hand, 155 yards. Hopefully we can just get one on it here. I've actually topped that. But oh my god guys, look at this. This is nearly going to run on the green. We'll take it. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Big one for par there guys, big one for par. Big one for par here guys, uphill. Big massive par pot uphill. Come down, keep going, keep going, keep going. Should be a top end bogey. Should be a top end bogey. I would like that being a bit closer than that. we have it guys top end bogey second shot killed me there with a top in it but anyway top end bogey we'll take it and only go to the par three so currently on hole six guys par three it's about 156 yards we've got eight iron in hand hopefully we can try and land one on the dance floor hopefully it's right at it it's got to be right at it Guys, look at that for an absolute shot. Right beside the pen, pen high we are. Get in there. So here we have it guys, we're pen high. This is for birdie. It's gotta be one of the best strikes I've ever hit in this hole. Big birdie putt. Stop, stop. I don't even know where I was aiming there. Top end par hopefully and then we go to the next. There we have it guys, par. Cars are flying in the day, finally. Now in hole seven, guys. Hardest on the course, stroke index one. It's a long, long par four. To get on here in two, you're doing good. You're doing really good. Stroke index one, par four. I think it's like 480 yards. Straight down the middle. A little bit, a little bit of a fade in that. Should be a good shot though. Yes, guys, just down there, right hand side. Rolled over a little hill. We'll take it. Not a bad strike. Shot two, guys. Here we go. Then. Green's cleared. So we can just get one out. It's not a bad strike. I should roll down that hill. I'll see if I get on the green. I'll be happy. Keep going. Keep going. Maybe it's just cut short, has it? It's just at the front of the green, guys. So, third shot, guys. Just at the front of the green. Just try and get it up the hill. A little bump around with the pitching wedge. 
exactly what I wanted. Come on, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. From here it looks okay, but I think it's rolled a little bit more than I expected it to, so big putt for par. Big par attempt guys. Looks straight enough. It does look straight enough now. I do think I need to cut more or less come this way and it will hopefully turn. I'm hoping it turns. But anyway, big putt for par. No pressure. Didn't hit it. I didn't hit it. I done what I done the par three. This is big for bogey. There we have it guys. A bogey on the hardest hole on the course. We'll take it. We're now in hole eight now guys. Dog leg par five. Dog leg par five. Me aim here for, for this hole guys is the trees up here to the left hand side. If I can try and cut the last biggest tree but to the right of it. Guys I tell you what, that's not a bad drive. That is not a bad drive. That is actually a big big hit down there. I'll have a nice line in and uh yeah, it shouldn't leave me too far of a shot in for a second shot, but let's let's keep this going. Still 229 yards to go, guys. I'm just going to try and lay up, maybe. I'm going to be a big wuss and try and lay up anyway. I'm going to try and hit a five iron. Leave myself a nice little soft pitching wedge in. That's the aim anyway. So five iron in hand, 229. Try and leave myself 80, 70 odd yards on here. So 100 yards in guys, pitching wedge in hand, just try and get one up the hill. A little bit left of it. A little bit left of it guys, not a great strike. Shot, shot four is this guys? Play one, two there, three, shot four guys, wow. Shot four, pitching wedge in hand, just try and get a nice little one up the hill. Get it close to the green. Tell you what, come on, stick. Go on the hole, go on the hole. Oh, it's just skim the pin. Please don't go down the hill. I've literally just skimmed the pin. For par here, guys. Literally, I'm not joking, I've literally just skimmed the pin. Big par pot here. A little bit too greedy for that there. Come down, come down, come down, come down, come down. Hopefully that's a little knock in for bogey. Big for bogey. There we have it guys. Bogey on the 8th, one to forget about. But we'll take bogeys, we should be happy with bogeys. And anyway, on we go to hole 9, which is another par 5. Hole 9 guys. Hole 9. Par 5, last hole on the video. It's not the biggest of par 5, you can be on here in 2. But anyway, we need one down the middle, we need to try and avoid them electric lines and also avoid the bunkers we like to be over the bunkers but anyway let's get to it i tell you what that has got to be perfect yep run around the trees up there right hand side it's literally went right around them we should have a good shot in here hopefully we have a good shot in here let's go and check it out so we're currently sitting 170 yards guys i've got a seven iron in hand kind of hoping i can really get one down here I'd be really happy to. 170 yards. Pens more or less. Looks like it's at the front. But hey, let's see if we can get one down here. Better left to right in that, and that looks actually alright. That should be on the green. Nice kick off the hill, and we're on the left hand side of the green, guys. Shot for you guys, just left hand side, short of the green. Pitching wedge in hand. Just try and do a nice little bump around. Wow, Dave, what were you playing at? What were you playing at? Should have maybe landed at halfway in between, but I didn't. I got greedy. Big putt for birdie, guys. A little bit of right to left in this here. Definitely gonna have to go up the hill and just tab it, I think, maybe. Well, and I've hardly hit that. I have hardly hit that. Wow, hardly hit it, and I've left it massive for par. And he's just missed the par, don't believe it. Just free putt it on the par five. But there we have it guys. That's the final hole in the video. Final hole in the video, hope you've enjoyed this one guys. A little bit warm today wearing the jumper. Don't know why I wore it. But anyway, hope you enjoyed this one. Don't forget to go down and hit the like button. And also don't forget to go down and smash the subscribe button. It'd be very much appreciated. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. And uh, see you next time. Enjoy.